I used to punch the hole for drainage and where we are going to put the plant. The scissors, I used to cut this hole here. The string, I'll show you how to use this when we are going to finish. First, let us put the point into the plant. slightly above the holes that we punch and I prefer wet soil because when you are planting the plant will be compact. My soil is already wet and it's three quarter of the container. Now we want to start planting. We do like this. This is why I was saying I prefer wet soil because when you'll be putting the plant they will be compact. put them here and you see I've spaced the holes because I want I don't want the plants to be near each other. I need them to have space for them to fill the container. one type of corneas but you can mix any plants that you want so long as the roots are not big now I want to add marigold here you can also add some mint here mm -hmm. here this like this after planting now we want to use the string of the cords that we we'll use when hanging them on the walls. I've already punched some holes here. They are two. You punch them you punch below here and up here. Like this. And then like this. You see? And then you do like this. Make sure it's tightly. You put it tightly and it has a tight knot so that it cannot fall from the wall. Like so in the knot on the other side, you come to the other side. This side we don't need to punch a hole because we already have this one here. We take the rope. Mine is a bit longer. I don't want to cut it because this is just a demonstration. But uh, there's another planter that I've already done. I'll show you next. You put it this way. You tie it. This kind of a planter needs where there is a bit of sunlight let's say like three hours or four hours of sunlight in a day because the couriers don't like direct sunlight so you can operate this one but there's another one that 
Mexican grass and I have box books. I want to show you how you can put it on the wall. Just for demonstration purposes, because it doesn't belong here, here I usually put other things, but I want to show to show you the exact place where I'd put it, where it grew like you can also use a tin. You don't have to use a jerry can only. You can use a tin and punch holes on the side and plant some other plants on top there. This one is another one that I planted earlier. 